doing? What are you doing? Hey, is nasty. I'm the shish kebab master. Shish all these different things. Shish kebabs. We got burgers. We got onions. We got beef. We got shrimp. We got chicken. We got kibasa. We got pineapple. We got peppers. kibasa has gone. Yeah, no more kibasa. And we got zucchini. I think we have too many things. You need to what see the... We got another smoky situation here on the grill. But we're not fired up. We're just, we got 16 burgers on the grill. We still got four more to cook. I think we're going to have plenty. Yeah, I think we have a little bit of food left over. Just a little bit. First 4th of July, where I was wearing a sweatshirt and I had <laughs> pants on. It's like 65 degrees out here. But two hours later, we're almost done cooking on the grill. Bye. <laughs> hey, jump in there. <laughs> run, go, jump, run. <laughs> Her mom and dad have lots of fluffy bed sheets. <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> okay, you ready? Get set, go. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Crawl to it. She's mixing her. She doesn't push that. Do you see him? Hold it up to your eye. Hold it up to your eye. <laughs> Not your ear. Hold it up to your eye. Yeah. Not your nose. Here we go. Nose. You put the tube up to your eye. Once again, we're driving above the clouds. Now what I think would be cool is if I took the drone up on a morning like this where the fog's laying low and see what it looks like from above. But I'm not sure how that like affects the drone. I'm not sure if like taking it through the clouds would be the greatest thing. Um, Cause obviously there's moisture in the clouds and I'm not sure you know how much moisture it can take before it starts to like wig out. So yeah, I think that'd be cool though. But I should probably do a little bit more reading up before I send the drone flying through fog and dense clouds. <laughs> That'd probably be a good idea. Man, I tell you what, the things I do for a video, here we go, it's a little better. Um, I'm back here at the pond for like a half an hour when the Pokemon Go servers are down, trying to record some footage of this game working so I can make my video for it. And I think I got all bit up. I felt bugs biting my arms, my legs the whole time. And so, man, the sacrifices you gotta make to make a good YouTube video. It looks like it's fixing to rain. What? But here, Summer's gonna do a little shopping here. I can do a little shopping. I ain't, well, I guess I could do some shopping, but I don't plan on it. Addictive apparel, apparel, addictive apparel, addictive apparel. It's kind of like, uh, not like a secondhand shop, but like, it's new, stuff. it's new stuff from like name brands, but they sell for cheaper. So hey, you can't go wrong. For this pair of jeans, take a guess. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. Donut 
the word. <laughs> this is really shopping music year. Where'd Summer go? She's missing. There she is in her natural habitat. Okay, so I don't understand. I thought this place was supposed to be cheap clothes, but apparently not. Because there was some clothes like that were on like the rack she was looking at for like 80 bucks. I'm like, I could hand make this myself for five. Like, and their shorts were like 60 bucks, yeah, 80 let's bucks. Let's be real. You could probably make a, I don't even know what. I can make a t-shirt like this, just plain Jane, and like scribble my name on it. But I mean, way too expensive. I would never pay sixty dollars, eighty dollars, anything Tyler's like that for a pair of shorts. Would be made with like Walmart fabric with magic markers. Probably, and it would work just as well as these expensive clothes. But I, I'm a person <laughs> okay. who doesn't understand spending eighty dollars on a pair of shorts. What I can get a pair just fine for like. 15 20 bucks I, but some people like buying expensive clothes that's their thing you know i like buying expensive cameras and drones you know to each their own i guess oh man battery's 15 percent low i just caught an eevee i'm in the middle of an alley here in everett and there was a we're stopped in the middle of the road and i'm making sure there's nobody coming and then there's also a, uh an abra sitting right there i gotta get him yes a wild abra i'm gonna get this guy oh there's a car right there Excellent. I just caught him. I'm getting way too excited about this. People are way too excited about this game. I think I can go. Uh, Tyler. Gotcha. I got him. Abra in my possession. Okay, where do I go? How's your cheesesteak? Good as usual. We're at the original Italian pizza. I got myself a uh, calzone, some breaded cauliflower, and somewhere got the cheesesteak. The usual. Pretty good stuff. Oh yeah, we caught Bell Sprouts on Pokemon Go and got Summer to download it too. Now she can be addicted just like me. I see what Pokemon's trying to do. They're trying, They're to, trying to get everybody to work out. So now we're walking around town. <laughs> we gotta find some Pokestops to Pokemon. This is like the ultimate scheme to get people to work out. Just walk around looking for Pokemon all day long. Wait. What? Oh, I got real excited. <laughs> There's a guy over there walking. Right over there. He's a guy we ran into that was looking for Pokemon as well. He's still walking around an hour later. Uh, we just did a little bit of a walk just to find some stuff. My phone's about dead, but Summer, she's cashing in and finding a bunch of stuff. So, uh, yeah, I gotta charge my phone up before I get on the real hunt. <laughs> this is what happens. My phone dies and Summer sits here and cashes in on all the Pidgeys and the Spearows in the whole world. <laughs> now she's rubbing it in that she probably has more Pokemon than me. Wait, there was just one right here. Right here. Oh, he's further toward Walmart. I'll take a walk. Let's not get hit by a car. Man, Legos are a lot more expensive than they used to be. I was gonna get this set um, for a video idea, but 35 bucks, I think I might hold off on that one. A beautiful day for a picnic. Hey, it's pretty I nice outside. I thought you were calling me beautiful. Well, with a beautiful wife and a beautiful life. That rhymes. And uh, picnic's up here at Pavia, and there's a pool down there. Oh, right here. Is there a way to walk down? Yeah. Oh, down here it is. And I guess it's like a community pool. I don't know if there's any lifeguards on duty or anything. Pretty nice looking pool here, and it's just out in the middle of nowhere. As you can see, it's used by the community quite a bit. But nice pool for being out in the middle of nowhere, though. I don't know how that draft got here, but he's a beast, that's for sure. The old Allen Bank Classic Weekend. Lots of cars, lots of vendors, lots of bikes, lots of people, and a lot nicer than it was last year. Last year, it was like a mud pit in here. Hey, I'm Would trying. You please come out of the pavilion and I'm... form a line up towards the fire hall. Good grief, I'm trying to vlog here. Not supposed to rain, but definitely look like it might. Dinosaur has a little bit of a snaggle tooth. I don't know, but it's kind of messed up if you think about it. Dinosaur's here and you slide down into the dinosaurs behind. <laughs> that's just, that's only a little bit weird. Just a little bit. <laughs> that's it. That, that's it. This is some high powered live action right here.
Oh yeah. Good grief. Good grief. down me and rebels now i'm gonna go into the part that's ripped down arrest me now remember this catchphrase selfishness is the thief of honor eating food again eating food again look my you can't even see the top of my face because of the sun <laughs> our, our bases you can't see them uh i ordered one scoop of moose tracks that looks like three scoops to me, but I won't complain. It's really lean and I better take care of it. I hate I'd to see what two scoops is. How tall is it supposed yeah, to be? Yeah, probably. But maybe like a scoop tall, like an ice cream scoop tall. Either way, a lot of ice cream. This dang Pokemon game has <laughs> gotten ridiculous. It's so much so that I have to leave work at lunch, like I had food to take, to come sit at this stupid Pokestop so I can get more Pokeballs Pokeballs for grammatically correct so I can play the actual game because I ran out and I ain't spending money I ain't spending real life money on this game. It's free and apparently you can get coins by Owning gyms. Well, I couldn't beat the gym. I was at yesterday because the server wiped out on me And so the only way to do it is to get to get pokeballs is to go to these stops And there's one like two minutes away from work. So I'm just gonna sit here. They refresh every five minutes So at least if I can get like I don't know 15 pokeballs or something off to a good start maybe stop at some places after work and uh, refill up and maybe try to beat a gym that way I can get some money or something but uh yeah this game taking like dedication to a whole nother level well back home it's Monday again another Monday already and uh time to end the old vloggity blog and uh needless to say Pokemon Go has captured the attention of millions of people it's already the top app on all these app stores um people are driving around walking around people are getting arrested somebody caused a multi-vehicle accident online people are walking into police stations all kinds of crazy stuff uh apparently a girl also found a dead body playing the game which is really weird and really creepy um but yeah pokemon go is taking the world by storm um pretty much everybody that i talk to likes it and if they don't like it they're like yeah whatever um there's a very very small percentage of people that are just like oh that's so dumb um but hey what do you got to do? All right. <laughs> Mom had to bring me some books. Because um, we're going on a trip to Montana in August. Um, one of them is Attacklands by Mark Geppert. Um, we're going to, uh, what is it, Crow and Cheyenne Indian Reservation um, for like a week. Uh, but there will be plenty of traveling on the way. What are you doing trying to hide? So you were swimming in the pool. It's all right. Yeah, well, people are just mental. Um, and... Yeah, we're going to be driving, so we're going to be a lot of sightseeing, so it'll be a lot of footage, seeing all kinds of crazy stuff, and uh, yeah, it'll be good. And so I need to finish this vlog, uh, edit it, and upload it for tonight. Um, what is that? It's something like in sync. It's the Cheetah Girls. Oh, the Cheetah Girls? Mm. When I left in the Cinderella by the Cheetah Girls. You guys remember the Cheetah Girls? Cheetah Girls, Cheetah Sisters, or something like that? Uh, yeah, that... Good times. I wonder where all the cheetah girls are at nowadays. Probably best if I didn't know. But uh, hey, thank you guys for watching. Thanks for the support and all the likes and the thumbs up. That's the same thing in the comments. And thank you for subscribing uh, for more videos. Um, didn't get my favorite camera video done last week. I hope to get it done this week. But I also have a Pokemon Go video I want to get up. Um, the my favorite camera video and maybe some other stuff. But uh, more videos on the channel. Always a good thing. And so all the social links down in the description below. Thank you guys again for watching. We'll see you guys in the next video.